now that I'm out because I'm using my jack so I've got to reseed these tires and put them down proper and bolt them in proper so I can use the jack on the truck I gotta jack this up and take this tire off and do some bolts I think I showed you once already where are we these two bolts here one two I gotta grind off and I gotta grind this off here like so and I gotta do the same on the other side and then I got to grind off that bolt and that bolt and then this thing will come crashing down and then we can remove the pumps and stuff and then we can tow the truck out how do I look getting on the highway looking for adventure and whatever comes my way yo baby gonna make it happen la, 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 la. one of these days one project at a time right oh, but we're getting we're getting things done we're getting things done two hours maybe three an hour and a half on each rim to grind them down and they're ready for paint the hub is ready the springs are ready the shock is loose and ready to come out all these brake lines just unscrew easy peasy I probably won't even disassemble any of this stuff and I'm just gonna spray the shit out of it right to here and then it'll be done. And then that's the corner. And then I do the same over there with that corner, but this corner is done already. This one is just the hub and the rims because the spring is done already. I gotta touch up some spots under here. I gotta drill a hole and touch up some spots. But the spring is done, as you can tell. The spring, all this is good. I stopped here. So I just got the hub. I just got the hub. And the two tires here on this side. And then this corner is done. And then I drop the gas tank. And spray the bay. And then spray the tank. And I'm ready actually to do that for two reasons. One, I drained her from gas, or drained her of gas, about a month ago on purpose, because I was going to do the gas tank first. But then I had to move her because they're going to be paving, and the truck is going to go, and I'm going in that spot. So I figured I didn't want to do that because if I didn't have my gas tank in, I'm not pushing this thing. <laughs> That's not happening. So, I'll have to have her moved over here by the time I get ready to drop the tank. So I got time to do these two, and then that is gonna get done, I guess, tomorrow. I was gonna get at it today, but it's on and off raining, and I don't wanna use my grinder with an electrical cord outside. I'm going to be precariously underneath the truck trying not to have a two-ton thing fall on me when I'm grinding, so if that's precarious enough on its own. But I like the tire. The tire turned out good. Now everything from here down is completely done, except for a couple of spots I want to touch up. And it's all of these spots here. And there's one spot here that I didn't get thick enough. But see all of these underneath? Because I couldn't get it thick enough under there. 
but everything else is good as you've seen already. Oh, 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 oh. I got a line on an air compressor. I am not joking. That would be... Oh, oh, if I got an air compressor. It's an eight gallon tank, so I'm hoping the tank is big enough, but I need an impact wrench, an air gun impact wrench. I'm not sure if an eight gallon tank is gonna be big enough to do uh, to use an impact wrench, but I gotta get the struts off and I can get the hubs off if I had an impact gun. So I might just buy this thing and then upgrade the tank to maybe a 20 gallon because I want one for the truck anyway and I'll just build a shelf and mount it underneath somewhere. Then I'll have an air compressor and hydraulics. That would be wicked. What else is there? Hmm. Oh, here's something cool. Okay, so my daughter doesn't live with me. I haven't talked about my daughter yet, and I probably won't. And there goes my paint. <clears throat> None of it exploded. That's awesome. Okay, so on my daughter's Facebook post, she like shared this meme, and it was the first one of its kind. It had like a picture of cigarette butts on one side of the meme and it said legal causes cancer and on the other side of the meme was a picture of weed and it said illegal cures cancer and then underneath it it said something like what the fuck WFT right? And I was pretty proud and impressed with my daughter today to post that. That's very cool. That is very cool. She's 14, she'll be 15 soon. So hopefully she's starting to realize and see and understand the world around her is all fucking screwed up. And it's run by criminals. That's what I'm taking, anyway, out of it. <laughs> anyway. What else is there? I don't think there's anything else. Fixed the leak with a hammer, but you just saw that. Yeah, I think that's everything. See ya. I've got to work on a tire. Got to get that all squared away.